Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to yours truly, Dolan. My name is Elijah. Everyone just calls me Dolan. And if you're new to the channel, I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button to be part of the Dolan family. If you just joined, welcome and thank you for taking a chance on me. On my day one, day ones, you are ready now. Alright, see ya. Alright y'all, you know what they say, the third time to charm. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Once again, we're gonna open up two more Loud Fly backpacks in this video, which is gonna be the last Christmas video because it's the end of Christmas in July, which I'm super sad. I wish we could celebrate Christmas all year long, but that's okay, because we'll be back here in a matter of a few months. But before we get into those backpacks, grab that snack and come on back. Hey my darlings, welcome back. So before we jump into the video, let me show you my little reindeer buddy right here. I actually got this last Christmas. I used it as a decoration. Maybe I'll use the blanket uh, this year. I love throws. I love throws. I love picture frames, uh, candles, mugs. Those are my favorite things for the holidays. So I was at Ralph's picking up something and I saw this on one of the end caps. It was the only one left and I thought it was adorable so I just had to get it. The little pink antlers, how cute is that? Her little pink nose, and so her legs wrap around the throw. That's what it looks like. So it's just a red blanket with like white snowflakes on it. And then on the back, she has it's supposed to be like little Christmas lights. So all along her back. So cute. So I thought I'd put this out and be a little festive for this video. Also, I feel like I'm missing something. Oh, I know. Oh, that's what we needed just a little touch we needed some christmas lights just to be extra little festive after all this is the last video so we're gonna go out with the bang so let's go ahead and start with that first bag all right here she is let's go ahead and crack her open all right here she is let's go ahead and see what we have all right, so I purchased this at Awesome Collectibles. Here she is, and she is looking fabulous, honey. So let's go ahead and get this plastic off. And you already know, let me go ahead and have my moment. This is a beautiful bag, so let me go ahead and turn her around, honey. Yes. So this is their cotton candy bag. This one I was actually waiting for a good, for a hot minute. This one I actually ordered probably, I want to say maybe four or five, could even be six months ago. But this was also a long wait. It's finally here and um, she's gorgeous. So let's go ahead and jump into this bag. So she does have functional pockets both sides and these pockets actually feel a little larger than most so that's a plus let's we'll start with the bottom we have a light pink the back plain plain pink matches the bottom the straps in the back also match again all this is vegan material matches the bow in the front which is also a matte finish so the hardware as far as the zipper is like a rose gold and then the zipper part is um, almost like, I wanna say a gold, almost a rose gold, but it's more of a, a gold uh, texture. And then you can see the zippers are like a rose gold. So it's like a two-tone, even in the back, the buckles are a rose gold. The plaque, y'all know I love the plaque, which is a light pink, very, very light baby pink. And of course it's outlined with gold. This is the front of the bag. And we got the sequence all the way around. Top, beautiful bag. All right, so let's go ahead and see what the interior looks like. So you can kind of see that. So it's like a light pink with white polka dots. Let's go ahead and check out the main compartment. So you can see it a little better here. So it's a light pink with white polka dots, so pretty. So again, I purchased this from Awesome Collectibles. 
This is not a first uh, from them. I think I've ordered maybe a good handful of times from them and all their bags I usually get are usually in good shape, packaged and wrapped well. So, so this is also gonna be part of my sequence line, which I'll probably show you at the end of the video. Anyways, I'll put her right here. All right, let's go ahead and get that second bag. All right, here it is. Let's go ahead and crack her open. All right, let's go ahead and see what we have. Receipt. Oh, beautiful, I can already see it through the package. Oh my goodness. And this bag I have been waiting to open forever. It's literally been sitting in the studio so long. Um, I also want to give a big shout out to Crystal. Crystal was the one who actually told me about this bag and where I could find it. I went to that website. It was still available. I snatched it up so quick. This actually company was located in, was located in the UK. So this bag came from overseas and I did pay a little extra y'all, like 20, an extra 20 bucks on top of what the bag and all the tax and all that stuff just to get it here. But Crystal, thank you so much for giving me that website and letting me know where I could find this bag. And I just thought it was appropriate to end the video with this bag. So let's go ahead and get that plastic off. Oh my goodness. All right, let's get the tissue off. Oh. Oh. And you already know, let me have my moment. Oh my gosh. All right, you all, let me go ahead and turn her around, but I'm still having a moment. I'm still having a moment. Oh my gosh, she is beautiful. <sighs> okay, oh, let me take the ear protectors off. All right, y'all. All right, so let me go ahead and turn her around. Oh my goodness, y'all. So this is the red mini sequin bag and it is a Christmas bag but I mean just look at that shimmer y'all the size so the ears too in the back in the front it is just oh my gosh it's beautiful completely stunning she's just stunning y'all all right so and she has silver hardware you all so I'm seeing not only Christmas, I mean, obviously, because you can see the zipper pool has a snowflake, but definitely Valentine's Day. I'm also seeing Judy Garland, honey, yes, those Dorothy, the red ruby slippers. Oh my gosh. I am a huge Wizard of Oz fan. I love the Wizard of Oz movie, my ultimate favorite, favorite, favorite movie. Dorothy, those red shoes, honey, yes. All right, so let me show you all a close up. Oh my gosh. Stunning. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the bottom. Let's tell the bottom. It also has like a red metallic bottom. Almost like a candy apple red. Okay, so the whole pouch is glittered or sequenced out. Let's have a close up of that zipper pull. Beautiful. Silver hardware. And look at that plaque. Look at the bow. Y'all see, it's not like a matte, it's more of a metallic. That is beautiful. Almost feels like some kind of plastic material. But yes, okay, and in the front, zippers, silver. Yes, the hardware is silver. The ears, y'all look at that, beautiful. Okay, so the back. Now the straps are also like a metallic, a red metallic. You can see that's beautiful. So this is uh, different. Most of them are more of a material where it's more uh, like a spongy uh, type of thing, but this is more of like a plastic. So this one you probably might have to be careful because when it bends, it'll probably get a little ugly. But on the back too is the same. Very pretty along with the bottom. 
Yes. Ooh. I'm just loving this bag. All right, let's see what the interior looks like. Now this is super cute. Now I know you probably can't see it too well here, but we have, it's red and then I think it's white or silver and I think it has like uh, Mickey's head. All right, let's check out the main compartment. Also, this was on one of the first bags that I actually opened and it has the same thing. So the zipper pull, I don't know if y'all can see that. It's red, it's material. Usually the zipper uh, pull is hardware, like uh, metal. This is uh, material, red material, like that plastic. On the tip of the zipper, y'all see that little Mickey, it's like a, a metal hard Mickey piece. You can see it right there on the tip of the end. It's on both, so it has it on the end of this one. And it's right here, but how pretty that is. Yeah, so the little details, y'all. All right, let's see the main compartment. And it's just like butter, y'all. The zipper, so easy, so smooth. And this is gorgeous. Look at that, y'all. Even the inside, wow. So it's almost like a metallic finish. It does have Mickey Mouse in there. And it's so gorgeous. I just love that. Totally Valentine vibes, right? Christmas. So here she is. I'm just loving it. This is one of my favorite, favorite bags. I said it's been here in the studio like for so long. Um, I just thought it was appropriate to open it on the last day of Christmas in July. So let me go ahead and get that other one out. We have this here and then we have the cotton candy. Now the cotton candy, I did notice, um, it's beautiful. It's a pretty color. It's still part of the sequence line. However, the sequence is kind of like a little toned down. As you can see, this one is like head on, sparkly, shiny. And this one's a little shiny, but it's more, it has like more of a matte look to it. So, but that's fine. It's still a gorgeous bag. Um, I just wish it had a little bit more shine, like Dolan over here. All right, y'all, I have a few more of these, so let me go ahead and bring those out. All right, so if you missed the last video, you can go ahead and click on that. I did that about a week ago. I'm not gonna get into detail, I just wanna show you real quick that this is also one of the newest ones to my sequence line, and this is the uh, magenta bag. Sequence all the way around and on top, behind the ears. We got this iridescent metallic looking in the back. So this is the uh, magenta mini bag. Also in that video, I was also showing you, this is also new to my line. And this is the orchid uh, mini bag. So same thing, we got a sequence all the way around the bag. The top, behind the ears, the sides. The bottom is like a matte pink. Nothing on the back, the back is also plain as well as the bottom. Again, I go more in detail, so if you missed it, you can go back to my last video, and I do uh, talk about both of these bags, but these are new to me. So I have one more, here she is. So this is the silver bag, and this was actually the first bag I showed you all before um, all the other ones came in. But this is all silver, but it does have a little hint of like rainbow strap, just like all the other ones. Sequence all around. We have like this metallic iridescent bottom as well as the back and then the uh, straps also match as well it's a beautiful bag so this bag i also did probably about um maybe close to a month maybe two months ago um the plaque is also beautiful and then you see it has glitter inside as well and for the uh, zipper pull you can see it's like the red one i just opened so it has a snowflake so a beautiful bag. So let me go ahead and bring them all out. All right, you all, here they are. All my sequins bag. I'm just loving, loving this red one. I love all of them. Y'all know me, more sparkle, the better. But anyways, this is the ending of Christmas in July. I'm so sad, but like I said, no worries, you all. We'll be back here in a couple of months uh, doing more Christmas stuff once again. So thank you, Crystal, again, for letting me know about this red sequence bag. I'm super excited. I can't wait to put it on my shelf. That'll be another video, you all. Toward the end of the year, we're going to go over all the bags that I got for this year coming soon. But other than that, happy Christmas in July for our last video, you all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all are enjoying these videos or enjoyed all these videos. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. It truly helps me and the channel out tremendously. Also helps others to see this video as well. Have a beautiful weekend. Stay safe. As always, I love you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.